Hi guys, it's Kat. Today, I'm going to show you how to make some miniature trestle desks. These look super modern and the trestle legs will make the height of the desk completely adjustable. You know, just in case your mini dolls want a standing desk. I'll show you a version with a solid wood tabletop and one with a clear acrylic tabletop. Let's get started. The first and main thing you need is some popsicle sticks. Take one and cut off the round end so you end up with a 2.5 inch piece. Make 4 of these. Also cut out 3 2.25 inch pieces, 2 1.25 inch pieces, and 2 1 inch pieces. Take 2 of the 2.25 inch pieces. Draw a line straight down the middle of the long side and cut it in half. Do this for both of the 2.25 inch pieces so you end up with 4 in total. Take 1 and file one of the long sides at a slight angle. Add glue to that edge and place another piece on top of it. See how the angle helps create sort of a backwards number 7 shape? That's what you want. Do this to the other side as well so you end up with two of these number 7 shapes. Next, add glue close to the ends of the angle piece and place a 2.5 inch leg on each side. Do this to the other side as well. These two sets will form the basic triangular shape of the trestle. Now take the last 2.25 inch piece and the two 1 inch pieces. We'll be gluing these small lengths on top of the long one. But before we do that, let's drill some holes into these little guys. I first draw 5 dots and then use a tiny drill to go through the wood. These holes are pretty small, so I go in with a bigger drill to widen the holes. There, that's better. Do this for both of the 1 inch pieces. Now I can glue them onto the longer 2 and a quarter inch piece. Glue each piece about a quarter of an inch away from the ends. This top piece will go in between the angle legs. Almost there guys, just a few more steps. Take the last two one and a quarter inch pieces and cut off a slight angle off each end. You'll end up with trapezoid shape. Do this for both pieces. Then just glue them onto the legs of your trestles. These will act as leg braces and hold the whole piece together. Now you can see how this whole thing will function. This top piece will go up and down making the height adjustable. To help hold it in place, I grab some craft matchsticks. Cut off two 1 6 inch bits. Add them to the ends of the middle gap. Now this top piece will slide in snugly but won't fall out. We'll be making some tiny dowels to keep the height fixed, but first let's make a bottom shelf for this little guy. Take some thin coffee stirrers and cut out 4 1 and 3 4 inch pieces. Add wood glue to the top area of the leg braces and add the coffee stirrers in place. There, now you have a shelf. Alright, now let's make the tiny dowels we mentioned. I'll be using some toothpicks here. Take one and file it down to make it thin enough to fit into the holes we made. Once it fits in tightly, cut out two half inch pieces. Now all you need to do is select the height you want and stick these tiny dowels in place. You can change the position of the dowels for a taller or shorter table height. Make another trestle so you have two in total. We'll need two of these to make a desk. Next step, let's paint these guys. I'm going to make these black, but you can leave them bare or stain them in any other color you like. I'm just using black acrylic paint here. I add on about two coats for this look. Look at how cute these little guys are. Last and final step, let's build a tabletop. I'll make the wooden one first. From a thin 1 8 of an inch piece of craft plywood, I cut out a 2.5 by 5 inch rectangle. I just run my X-Acto knife on both sides and snap the wood off. Sand it to smooth out any rough edges and paint it in any color you like. I'll be going for a nice clean white here. Once that's dry, just place it on top of the trestles. Super clean look. To make one that looks like glass, I'll be using this 1 8 of an inch thick polycarbonate plastic sheet. I draw out a 2 and a half inch by 5 inch rectangle and cut that out. Because I don't like using power tools unless I have to, I'll be using this hacksaw to cut the plastic out. As usual, all the products I use and links to where I get them are listed in the description box below. Sand the edges lightly and peel off the plastic packaging. And look how pretty that is, clear as glass. Place that on the trestles and now you have an ultra sleek modern desk. You can glue these down but I chose to leave them free floating. And that's it guys, these trestles make the perfect desk legs and they're as functional as they are adorable. I hope you guys liked this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did and make sure to subscribe for more. I'll see you next time, bye!